Today we're going to transform makeup into weird school supplies to prank our friends. Come on, join us! What a cute notebook! Oh, it's a makeup case! It'll take a little effort to transform a plain notebook into a wonderful makeup case. Apply stationary glue to the notebook edge. You can use white glue instead. Cut out the pages with a craft knife. Peel them off one by one. Glue the edges inside. Fasten with binder clips. Cut off the excess front pages. Attach a mirror using double-sided tape. Attach self-adhesive velvet paper to the cover. We've measured it out to fit the notebook. Add some embellishments. Done! I want to apply my lipstick. What's this in my friend's hands? I thought it was a notebook, but it appears to be a makeup case. There's a mirror and all the necessary stuff inside. You can put such an awesome makeup case safely on your desk when you're at school. No one will guess what it actually is. A black makeup marker? Why not? Cut off the top. Remove the wadding. Apply hot glue inside. Put in a brow gel vial. A thin mascara or lip gloss container will do as well. I urgently need to write something down. I grasp a marker at hand, but my friend takes it from me. She shows what it really is. It's not a school supply anymore, but a beauty product to take care of your brows. It's a great idea for school. Nobody thinks the makeup is inside. Multicolor plastic stickers are perfect when using as bookmarks, but we'll use them as eye wing stencils. And besides, we'll pour the eyeliner into a glue or correction fluid bottle. Let's get started with cleaning the glue bottle. Cut off the brush. We won't need it anymore. Remove the eyeliner brush. Hot glue into the glue top. The eyeliner brush is a bit shorter than that of the glue so we'll have to make the bottle smaller. It'll let the brush reach the bottom. Use hot glue. Remove the wiper from the eyeliner bottle. Pour the makeup into the glue bottle. I want to apply my eyeliner, but how to make it perfect? I take a plastic sticker from my friend's book and attach it beneath my eyelid. I use the glue bottle to apply my eyeliner with the sticker stencil. My friend can't understand what's going on. There's a bottle labeled glue with eyeliner inside. Take off the sticker. Perfect! Now you can return the sticker to your friend. Do you think it's impossible to moisturize your lips or apply lip balm with your pen? Though it sounds weird, it's possible. Remove the plug from a pen. It's rounded top of yellow color. Fasten the refill with hot glue. Pour hot glue onto a piece of plastic. Submerge a pen with the same shaped plug in oil. Put it in the hot glue to make a mold. You can rotate the pen holding it upright. When the glue hardens, remove the pen. Cut out a piece of lip balm. Melt it, adding yellow pigment or eyeshadow. Pour it in the glue mold. Carefully remove when cool. Pour a little of the melted balm into the pen. Attach the new plug. The pen looks exactly like it used to. The difference is a lip care feature. You can use your pen now to moisturize your lips. If you add the color of your favorite lipstick, you'll be able to apply tone on your lips. Does your friend need a pen? I look for it in my makeup bag. Aha! Here it is! It's not a plain pen, but a lip balm topped one. It can both write as a pen and care for my lips as lip balm. My friend is astonished. She's never seen such an awesome thing. What about an unusual makeup set shaped like an artist palette? Let's make it together! Have you dropped your makeup bag, breaking your beauty set into pieces? Don't throw it away! We'll show how to give it a second life. Crush your broken eyeshadow with a wooden stick. Transfer it onto a plastic palette. Add glitter, broken powder, and remains of the blush you don't use anymore. Put a few drops of vitamin E in the glitter. Add rubbing alcohol into the eyeshadow, blush, and powder. Mix carefully to get a dough consistency. Place a paper napkin on top and press over. The excess moisture is left on the paper while the eyeshadow turns solid. Melt Vaseline in a microwave. Put in glitter and mix up. Take lipstick you don't use anymore. 
Add it into the liquid Vaseline. Melt it in the microwave. Pour it onto the palette. Trace the plastic detail on color cardstock. Cut out three of the same details, two for the top and one for the bottom. We've changed the shape a little to fasten the details. Glue the two details to make a firm top. Decorate it to imitate an artist palette. Cut out color paper details following the paint shapes on the plastic palette. Attach them to the top. Cut out a thumb hole. Use a craft knife. Align the top and the bottom. Punch two holes to fasten the details. Attach the plastic palette to the cardboard bottom. Cut out the thumb hole like you did in the top. Cover the set. Fasten it with a ribbon. Are you going to paint? Here are the paints, but you can't use them to make a pattern on paper. Apply them on your skin to create a gorgeous makeup look instead. I've got a wonderful brush for it. Take the softest art brush you can find. Trim it flat. Now it's perfect to apply eyeshadow. Let's test it. Cool! If you don't have a makeup brush, use this one. Apply the glittered lip gloss. Pretty girls! Let's take a selfie. Add some eyeshadow. The brush is great. I'm going to prank my friend with weird school supplies shaped as makeup. Cut off the tip of a marker that doesn't write anymore. Trim up a makeup pencil to fit the marker size. Put it in. Shade the wooden part in the marker color. Does your friend need a marker of a particular color? Give her your special one. She can't understand what's wrong with the marker. It looks like regular stationery, but writes in a different way. It certainly does, because it's an eye marker. It is! Don't you believe it? Okay, we'll reveal the secret. It's actually a makeup pencil inside the marker body. Then I'll prank her back with an eerie pencil. Wrap a piece of fabric around the metal end. Carefully remove it with the eraser inside. Mark the size on the makeup pencil end. Pair it. Put on the metal with the eraser. Apply stationary glue all around the pencil. Cover it in glitter. Fasten it with hairspray to prevent the glitter from coming off. Place the pencil among other pencils and markers. My friend will certainly notice the glitter-covered pencil. She likes stunning things. She sees the bright pencil and wants to use it. My friend's an artistic soul. She doesn't notice irrelevant things around her when she's into something. That's why she didn't notice it wasn't a plain pencil, but a makeup one and quickly rubbed it out against the paper. I wanted to prank her, but got the pencil that needed sharpening. An amazing pencil sharpener is a great way to prank your friend. Don't you know what to do with blush left over? Crush it with a wooden stick. Add rubbing alcohol and stir up. Shape a little ball. Make a few elements. A pink round pencil sharpener will make a perfect container for this DIY blush. Remove the sharpener. Cover the hole with a piece of plastic. Transfer the blush balls into the container. Add a little brush. No one will guess what it actually is. Oops! My pencil's broken, but I left my sharpener at home. I'll ask my friend to give it to me. It doesn't work. I should open it and see what's wrong. Oops! Something scattered out. Some pink balls and a brush. It's blush! It's a practical thing, by the way. The little round container fits in either my pencil case or makeup bag. I'll prank her back with blush in the glue stick container. Don't hurry to throw away your broken makeup. Use it to prank your friend. Crush the broken blush. Add some rubbing alcohol. Put in a few drops of vitamin E. Transfer the hot pink mixture into an empty glue stick container. We've cleaned up all the glue remains. Press it over with a paper napkin to get the excess moisture out. The leftover alcohol will evaporate soon. Does your friend need glue? Offer your special one to her. She opens it. What's this? Can the glue be made of this eerie color? Show her how it works. She wants to try it now. She seems to like it. 
This new school supply compilation will help you prank your friends and give a second life to your makeup. Don't throw away your broken makeup and use your favorite lipstick up to the end. Prank your friends and have fun! Don't forget to subscribe, feel free to comment, give your thumbs up and click the bell. Watch our new videos together with your friends.